You cannot be known by uh, even the demigods. You cannot be known even by the demigods. That means the Supreme Personality Godhead cannot be known even by greater personalities than the human being. And how a human being can understand Sri Krishna? without becoming his devotee. Therefore, uh, Bhagavad-gītā should be taken up in the spirit of devotee of Lord Sri Krishna. One should not think that he is equal on the same level of Sri Krishna, or one should not think that he is an ordinary personality, maybe a very great personality. No. Lord Sri Krishna is the Supreme Personality of Godhead. Uh, so at least theoretically on the statement of uh, Bhagavad-gītā or on the statement assertion of Arjuna, the uh, person who is trying to understand the Bhagavad-gītā, we should accept Sri Krishna uh, as the Supreme Personality of Godhead, and then with that submissive spirit, uh, unless one receives this Bhagavad-gītā in a submissive spirit and oral reception, it is very difficult to uh, understand Bhagavad Gita because it is a great uh, uh, mystery. <coughs> so, in this Bhagavad Gita, we may survey uh, what is this Bhagavad Gita. This Bhagavad Gita is meant for uh, delivering persons persons from the knee science of this material existence. Every man is in difficulty in so many ways, and as Arjuna also was in difficulty in the matter of fighting the battle of Purukshetra, and as such, he surrendered unto Sri Krishna, and therefore this Bhagavad Gita was spoken. Similarly, not only Arjuna, but every one of us is always full of anxieties due to our this material existence. Asadgraha. It is uh, our existence is in the uh, environment or atmosphere of non-existence. But actually we are not uh, a, a, a non-existent. Our existence is eternal. But somewhere or other we are put into this asat. Asat means which does not 
exist. Now, out of so many human beings who are actually inquiring about his position as to what he is, why he is put into this awkward position of suffering, unless one is open to this position that why I am suffering. I do not want all these sufferings. I have tried to make a solution of all these sufferings, but I have failed. Unless one is in that position, he is not to be considered a perfect human being. Humanity begins when these sort of inquiries are awakened in one's mind, in the Brahma Sutra, this inquiry is called Brahma Jignasa, Adhatu Brahma Jignasa. And every activity of a human being is to be considered a failure without having this inquiry in his mind. So uh, persons who have awakened this inquiry into his mind as to what I am, why I am suffering, where from I have come, or where I shall go after death, uh, when these inquiries come or awaken in the, uh, in the mind of a sane human being, then he is practically the, the right student for understanding Bhagavad Gita. And he must be Sadhava. Sadhava, he must have. A respect, a firm respect in the Supreme Personality of God. Such a person as the ideal person was Arjun. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Rama Rama.